Hello and welcome to our next uh, series of tutorial where we'll be learning to use MQTT. So first of all we'll start with Putty. Uh, we'll go with uh, the Wi-Fi mode and log into uh, the uh, Intel Edition board uh, using SSH. So first of all uh, let me uh, give an overview of what exactly MQTT protocol is. It's basically a lightweight protocol where there is a server, a remote server which we call broker. It's basically runs a service, set up service. A publisher node can uh, transmit certain data over a topic say for example a particular census data something and the subscriber are the nodes that can subscribe to this topic and asynchronously receives the, the data specific to the topic as and when they are published by the publisher both publisher and subscriber in this particular MQTT protocols are known as the clients now there are several servers and clients uh, available which provides both uh, brokers as well as the client services. Now our objective here would be to get the data published to the broker uh, from a remote server and uh, we are going to use uh, mosquito.org. Mosquito is an open source uh, 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 software that provides both broker as well as the client services and we are going to use the client services over here so let's just start get uh, log into our edition device now the first thing that we need to do is we need to install mosquito uh, in our edition device So once you install Mosquito, uh, uh, it will also install a broker as well as the client services. However, we are going to use a global uh, broker. Now we are going to uh, go to our SD card. Uh, I want to download the uh, Mosquito uh, software in my SD card. So let's just go to our SD card and download the Mosquito service. So, uh, just going back uh, over here, Mosquito also provides uh, a global broker running at uh, test.mosquito.org. So, once we install its services, we are going to use Edition as the publisher. We are going to publish our temperature data over here or some other data. You can download the Mosquito <coughs> distribution from this particular link. Uh, uh, just type the wget http mosquito.org slash file slash source slash mosquito hyphen 1.3.5.tar.gz I uh, suggest you to just check out with the latest build once you type this it will be downloaded in your SD card or if you don't have an SD card it's okay to uh, download it's a lightweight packet so you can download it uh, even in your root FS now once we have downloaded we are going to uh, first untar now because i'm using sd card uh, we need to give no same owner as the option with the command if you don't give this one sometimes it does not untar it uh, properly so because sd card is mounted and not part of the root fs so we're going to give no same owner and going to untar the a downloaded zip file once it's uh, being untarred or unzipped now we should uh, get inside the directory and uh, after ls we can see the files over there now just uh, in order to make it we'll make it with make with underscore srv is equal to no that's all so once you make uh, it's going to made and uh, going to get uh, installed in your uh, edition you don't have to 
uh, install anything else so it's going to install everything so it will start uh, compiling all the files and binding with the libraries so once it, it it's going to take about uh, uh, five minutes time once it uh, gets over we're going to come back and as you can see that it's been successfully done and uh, uh, once it is installed now it's time to test uh, if it's been installed correctly or not so once you have been installed uh, the you have two options basically uh, mosquito underscore pub uh, that is for publishing any topic uh, the command if you just type and press enter and if it shows the option you should understand that the mosquito has been installed uh, properly now uh, once it is uh, validated that the installation is successful we can actually uh, publish certain topics through this mosquito underscore sub first will be running a subscriber service says that uh, the service will be running as a demo and it can it will keep on receive asynchronous data from the broker so minus h you should specify the server address test.mosquito.org is a free test address just uh, and we should give port number which is default 1883 for all the my uh, mqtt protocols and if something uses https that is secured server it's going to be 8883 minus t which gives the topic name it's always a good uh, thing to um, organize the topic names in a hierarchical way so once you type everything and press enter you'll see that the uh, it's it's running as a service now what we want to do is we want to open another putty port through ssh load say open now uh, the subscriber service is waiting for the data which we are going to pass through a publishing uh, publisher service so yes, because mosquito has been installed let's uh, publish our service uh, from here so we're going to uh, put the data into the channel called groupum slash news which should appear uh, on your right side screen the subscriber service so mosquito underscore pub minus h the server address should be same now you you can also use iot dot eclipse dot org which is another free server or m 2 m dot eclipse dot org for testing your uh, pub sub protocol or my MQTT protocols you can see port number will give same minus T but because this is a publisher service you need to also give a minus M option where you need to actually publish the service so as you can see as I have typed the uh, message it had uh, gone to test.mosquito.org and appears uh, there immediately now let me change the survey let me change the message uh, yeah, you can see the message uh, having appeared uh, over here so in this way asynchronously we can um, have the data being uh, transmitted uh, now uh, the best thing about M uh, MQTT protocol is that you have also client so here is an Android client called my MQTT which is available in Google Play Store now I'm going to show you how to use this client see I have downloaded this app my MQTT I have given the server and I'm giving publish so as I say publish the data you can see uh, appears from mobile to our subscriber service now you can play around the, have uh, a Python client or Node.js client and get the data remotely from your uh, mobiles or web pages through uh, MQTT and uh, control your GPIO pins well that's all for this tutorial hope you've enjoyed and uh, learned thanks for watching uh, thank you